quite frequently, and I think is a source of confusion in graph theory, is how do you know if you have accidental crossings? Or how do you know if every edge crossing forms a vertice? In other words, if I just draw these edges right here, how do I know, for example, that the locations at which these edges cross are in fact crossings? Or are they accidental? Accidental means, well, there's no vertice here or here. Right? Maybe there's a vertice here, here, here as well, and so forth. But how do you know if these are vertices or not? Um, and, and the idea is that, well, you don't know unless you know the context of the problem or if you see the phrasing plain graph like this. If the graph you're looking at is referred to as a plain graph, then yes, every line or edge that crosses is um, is a it does form a vertice. That's what a plane graph is. And in fact, I guess the idea is it's plane, right? You wouldn't see so much that the vertices are labeled at all. But when you see a graph like this, you can assume it, that every crossing is a vertice. So this is a vertice here. Oops. This is a vertice here. There has to be one here because these edges cross here as well, and so forth. Now those, those red vertices, or any vertices, wouldn't be drawn in. You would just see the edges, but in a plane graph, you can assume that yes, all the edges, all the times the edges cross, you do have a vertice. So just I wanted to clear that one up, that that's what a plane graph represents. Alright, thanks.